Your rubbish could end up being used to build roads in the future. The National Environmental Agency has awarded a tender for three companies to try this out. It is part of efforts to reduce waste and extend the lifespan of Simakal landfill. Nisha Rahim with more. This 3D printed bench is actually made from rubbish. It's the work of NEA and local firm Penn United Corporation. They call this material NUSEN. It's made from incinerated waste. The company is also trying to use it as an alternative to concrete. At the moment, NUSEN is being used at a replacement of 20%. If the uh, grading is better, then we will use more. But at the moment, we are keeping to 20%. It can be higher with better formulation. It has already been used for a 100-meter-long temporary footpath at our Tampanese hub. More footpaths like this could be in the works in the future. Now, this move of introducing new cents is part of Singapore's circular economy strategy to turn trash into treasure and reduce the amount of waste sent to the Samarkar landfill. Environment and Water Resources Minister Masago Zulkifli revealed on Monday that three companies had been awarded a tender to conduct field trials for new scent. They will treat around 3,000 tons of incinerated ash and try the material along Tanamira Coast Road starting next year. The data will be used to set environmental standards for using new scent. These standards are more comprehensive than those of other countries. Given our unique circumstances, as one of the few countries in the world to harvest urban stormwater on a large scale for our consumption. Our scientists and engineers have been challenged to break new ground. In another green initiative, Mr. Masagos announced that NEA will set energy efficiency standards for chilled water systems in industrial facilities from next year. That could help companies save hundreds of gigawatt hours and almost $40 million a year by 2025 and it will cut about 100,000 tons of carbon emissions annually.